handkerchiefs, some more blood code. I figured I would show you this menu right here, the items. These are considerable for different benefits and two of line will increase our magic abilities from certain shops. Third and fourth line are gifts that can only be given to boys. Why, why can't I give Allison a gift? What if I want to love her? Huh? How rude. What if I want to just be a good friend? Why can't I gift her? How dare you, game. You can only gift the boys after a date and you can buy them happy by happy shop convenience stores okay this last line contains items you can get through rewards certain through events magic house item system and they usually have powerful effects and then there was closet for outfits context is who we all know and it will fill up uh can we set the schedule or no it's just going to um go through that again so let's just click through it and see her being all happy and cute and we're going to exit the tutorial now and I'm just gonna click ready I need to finish the schedule okay what's this wind course fire course light course water course water free activities we're going to do the light course first and then the fire course to say the wind and an elective course Thursday free activities that day take a nap Friday uh do we do the water course? I don't think so. Water course. We already did the light course. The wind course. And then we'll do free activities again. And, up. and we'll go back. Is the schedule ske set? I think it is. Yes. Eight plus five plus fatigue. Eight plus five fatigue. That song is this the one Tremere played before I left? Is that him playing it again now? Probably. I can't forget Tremere is a vampire who naturally attends a school. He was one of the intruders. A young man could play such a gentle me melody. Possibly can't be a bad guy, could he? Maybe. You never know. Don't judge a book by its cover. <clears throat> Leo, it's good to see you again. Oh, sorry. I couldn't help but standing, uh, stopping when I heard the melody. I figured it was you playing. It feels like quite the last time since we spoke. How have you been recently? Yes. Uh, so, sort of, yes. Something happened with my family and I had to go home for a few weeks. I just came back to school. I see. You have a lot of interest in piano, don't you? Yes, I do. I took piano lessons for four to five years when I was a child. I still enjoy playing it when I have free time. You look really stressed, Leah. I don't know precisely the situation with your family is, but everything will be alright. You have to stay strong in times like these. Thank you. I will do my best. You're in the Department of Light magic aren't you are you gonna join the Kurt in the future i hope so it's been my dream to become an oreo and or oracle and <laughs> did i just say oreo <laughs> hold up did i just say oreo guys she wants to be an oreo <laughs> whoops mirror church it's always what my dad wanted me to do i'm sure your dream will come true no matter where you find yourself and the value of light magic will be recognized as long as you use it to cure and heal others sometime someone that recognizes that ad, is an admiral oracle of the light in my opinion i know saint mayor church is considered very sacred in everybody's belief believer's heart it was a great honor to become an oracle there i hope that my dad, even from heaven, is proud of me. I will believe. I will. 
I believe that he will feel it. I know he'll be there sharing honor with me and my dream will come true. It's a shame that y I won't be able to witness it with you. Vampires can't receive a baptism of light magic. Why do you say that? Anyone with kindness in their heart is favored by the light in regards of whether they're vampire or human. You play such a beautiful t tune it, which reminds me of the bright warm person you are. I would like you to be there when I become an oracle of light someday. Vampires are more willing to be friends with those who treat us as equals. Please call me from Locke now, from now on. Okay, Locke, I'd be happy to. Would you like to have a cup of coffee with me downtown to celebrate the start of our friendship? Coffee? Yes, there's a nice cafe located downtown. Would you like to go? Yes, let's go get going. Hello, Lance. You look like a little shorty. Landlady. Good afternoon, Tremel. Ah, you brought a girl along today, just when I thought I'd seen it all. What would you two like to drink? The usual for me, and how about you, Leah? Um, a cappuccino, please. You must be a regular if you have the usual order, huh? I've been coming here once a month for five years now. I've been a lawyer customer, so I know the manager really well. Four to five to eight years? You've lived here that long? Uh, aren't you familiar? Uh, familiar with ethic codes of vampires? Uh, no, but maybe you could teach me a little about them? Certainly. We vampires are not afraid of the sunlight since we came to this world, but strict monitoring procedures and ethical codes have been established so vampires can live peacefully with other species. One of my duties as a student council president, president of the Star Manor is to prevent vampires or half vampires from the school violating the racial agreement the rash rational agreement i think i don't know i don't even pass the word whoops okay i understand so if there's any vampires that want to attend the school you know right according to the rules all the vampires who enter the area are in charge to report to me however it's not always possible with the half-bloods because some of them don't even know their own heritage what do you do in a case like that we meet with the students every year and we can feel if someone is one of us. I see. Those intruders who escape the campus and then go through the procedures, maybe Locke knows something about it. Is something on your mind? Yo! Why would you say something like, oh, vampires are just a horrible species to a vampire? Why would you give me that? Option game. Um, nothing really. Here's your cup of coffee. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Ah, President, I knew I might have found you. You might be here when I couldn't find you at school. Who's your friend? I am Leah. I'm a freshman in the light Department of Light Magic. Oh, it's nice to meet you. Well, President, I'm really sorry to bother you, but there's some issues in the student council that need to be taken care of right away. Okay, Leah. I'm sorry, but I should go. That's okay, thank you for the coffee. Well, we'll meet up another time. Bye, Leo. Bye. Miss Elphines, what's up? Feel free to relax. I just wanted to have a small chat with you. I guess the Oracle didn't even tell you my name, but I'm D Dina Fim. Hi, Miss Fim. <laughs> Miss Fim, well, please call me Dina. You did a great job. I was going to give you some advice, but it seems you've already become close to... Trimmer, you can call me Leah. Locke Lock is a nice person. It wouldn't be hard for me to become friends with him. Well, please keep in touch with him and try your best to get some information. You can find anything you need. Anything, or I'll help you. Also, I'll also keep you up to date with my own findings. Sounds good. Alright. Okay, that's good enough for today. By the way, our coffee is really good, as you have noticed. You're welcome to my shop anytime for a cup. I really did love the coffee. Thank you. I'll definitely come back. Yeah, hopefully we'll uncover the truth, but I really don't trust them. They literally started lemonade it and then your dad died and you haven't wrapped your head around that and it's tilting me. But they could also be telling the truth, but I don't know. The word eliminated bothers me.
Leah, are you alright? Why are you standing there in a daze? Oh, don't worry, I was fine. I was just thinking about something. Well, let's head back to the dorms. Okay. Bam. Hey, Leah, is your class over? Yeah, oh, sorry. Were you talking to me? Yeah, are you okay? The I heard you talking to the teacher yesterday. I... Is there something you're not telling me? You can always tell me anything. We're friends, you know. I... Leo, you... Wait, there's a lot of people here. Come with me. This is classroom is empty. Nobody will hear us. Please don't keep it to yourself if something's bothering you. Is it about your dad? Yes, I'm really... I keep telling myself to stay strong, and I know my dad wouldn't want me to to see me crying over him all the time, but I just can't help it. Whenever I think about it, I'll never see dad again. I just... That's okay. You can't cry. Everybody's weak and feels sad at sometimes. I was very sad for a long time when my mother died when I was a little boy. My heart was shattered. Everyone feels sad sometimes, no matter who you are, but you have to remember those who love us would hate us to see us in despair like this all the time. So you shouldn't waste your time for crying. Your father wouldn't want you to focus on your own life and succeed so that he could be relieved and proud of you. I see. Thanks. Okay, I believe in you, Leia. You've always been that kind of girl that doesn't keep, let anything keep her down for long. I did not mean to click that. What am I doing? Did, what did I click? You're okay. Well, at least I can use the mouse to fix my error when I don't know how to fix it on the freaking controller. Thank you, Christ. Christ. Oh? Ooh, we get some options today. Can I save real quick? Eh. Let's do that. Okay, so we can go to the campus gate, go to the classroom, hallway, the dorm, the piano room. Um, let's go to the campus over here. What are you doing here? Nothing. I, I have to go. I'll see you later. See ya. Okay, that was interesting. Um, we'll go to the student council now. Good morning, Wa. Good morning, Leah. Are you collecting materials? Oh, yes. I shouldn't disturb you anymore then. Ah. Yay, our nap. Leah, you're here too? Yeah, I was, and I figured I would. was. I'm just going for a walk. Yeah, me too. I started to get bored sitting around my dorm. If you mind, if you don't mind, can I join you? Sure. Yay, the campus is really beautiful. I was just walking by the small lake over there. The water was really blue, and even for a few minutes, there were swans in it. Really? I would love to see them. Let's go have a look. Okay, let's go. I'll show you how to get there. I had to run to keep up with her, and I missed a few stairs. Are oh, you alright? Did you get hurt? Uh, thanks, but it looks like there won't be any bird watching for me today. <laughs> it hurts a lot. Well, we're close to the dorms. So I'll help you back to the dorm to rest. Then we'll stop by the clinic and get you some medicine, okay? Okay, I really appreciate it, Allison. I heard someone crying out from pain down the hallway. I didn't expect it would be you again, little lost Leo. Did you hurt yourself? Hi, Leo. I don't think it's anything serious, but I just sprained my ankle. I'll be fine after a little rest. Huh. Have you forgotten I'm a good doctor? Oh, that's right. Please help Leo, Professor. We really appreciate it. Oh, he's using magic. It doesn't hurt anymore. I don't feel the pain at all. That's incredible. How do you feel now? Try to stand up and walk a little bit. It feels perfectly fine and it doesn't hurt at all. Thank you so much. How about I buy you a cup of coffee to express my gratitude? I'd be happy to. Allison, you can come with us too. Thank you, but I shouldn't really. I have to make up my notes for class. <laughs> okay. I heard that your father passed away recently. I hope you're not taking it too hard. How about a sweet drinks to cheer you up? I'm a little surprised that you would choose something sweet. The coffee is really good here, after all, and I promise you it got- Yeah, I would like to try something new for a change. I'm used to the bitter 
taste of coffee by now and the same appliance applies to real life you know life experience and hardships can leave us bitter sometimes we should try to relax and try, uh, try something a little more sweet don't you think I think you have a point there I've had to do so much lately I haven't had time to unwind but I made you take a nap girl I think it'd be really good for you to relax you must be stressed with all going on with your life what kind of experience have you have you giving you inspiration choose this life sweet moments and thank you for the inspiration i guess i'll do that one literally a very smart it's hard to believe such a smart girl is in front of me is the same one that i got got lost on her way to the dorm oh stop teasing me about that would you it was my first week here, and you always bring that up. He likes teasing you. Haha, <laughs> okay, no more teasing. Sorry, little Leah, I should really get back to the planet now. Thank you for the drink, and I look forward to seeing you another time. Don't mention it. Bye-bye. Ooh, fatigue and some magic. Oh, it's Locke. Good evening, Locke. Good evening, Leo. What are you doing out so late? Well, I ate a little too much for dinner tonight, so I thought I'd take a walk to start burning off calories early. Huh. <laughs> I see. You mind if I join you? I've got nothing to do. Okay. Why do you seem so reluctant? Not... No. No, not at all. No, I'm just a bit uncomfortable because I had too much to eat dinner tonight. What did that delicious food What delicious food did you have that made you eat so much? I had half a mango mousse, a large cup of mocha and some snacks. Half of a mango mousse? I didn't know you were such a dessert level. I try not to eat it too often because I could put on weight if I ate too much of it. You're pretty slim to be honest. I think you might look better with a little weight. Bruh He's calling us skinny bones. <laughs> no, a girl would think if she's pretty, think she's pretty fat if they're fat. Uh, I'll just say this. My father loved desserts too, so I used to make them for him a lot. I was always trying different types of recipe and became a dessert lover myself. So that's how you first learned to make desserts. Yeah, it makes me sad knowing I'll never sh share another one together. I think your dad will be happy if you keep making them. He wouldn't want you to stop just because he can't share them with you anymore. Yeah, I think so too. Okay, it's pretty late now. We should really get back to the dorms and get some rest. Yeah, you're probably right. Let's go. Oh, gee. <laughs> At first I was like... Oh, did we get to pick another schedule? But it looks like we get to pick where to go now. Let's go to the piano room and then the dorm. Okay, go to the dorm. Nothing happened. And I'm guessing we have to schedule again. Okay, we'll do the light course. It won't let me do the light course. Oh, we can't do it in the same order. Let's do... What can we do? Can we... Can we leave then? I, I, I literally tried clicking on it and it's like, nope. Another Monday is coming. I, I hope I sleep better tonight. Okay, now can I do the schedule? Yes, I can. We'll do the elective course. A free activity on Tuesday. Some light magic Wednesday. A water course. A nap. Did we do the wind yet? I don't think we did the fire course yet. And then I'll go that. And we'll click up. Oh wait, no! 
I wanted it that way. I just messed it up. I forgot I hit it hit back. Okay, elective wind light free activities a nap. Um, fire and water. Okay, and did I, <laughs> I feel like I might have did two of them twice. Let let me just fix it. Electric course. Water, light, fire, take a nap, wind, free activities, and that's how we'll do it like that. And now we will click ready. Dude, I like these little chubby animations. It's so cute. I see another s sparrow with injured wings. It probably can be healed with some sort of light magic. I should get to the library right away. Rescue treatment emergency. Which one do I need, Leo? Ah, oh, Leo. What are you doing in the middle of the medical section? Looking for something? I saw an injured animal on my way to camp. I've seen a lot of injured animals on my way to campus lately. I really want to help them, so I thought I'd check on some books on medical magic to study the form. I see. Little Leah is very kind-hearted. The textbook is here. Elementary medical light manual for animals animals might help you that sounds perfect thank you would you like a little instruction and prefer to try it on your own and with that i will see you guys in the next episode thank you all so much for watching and i will see you in the next video i do don't forget to comment like and subscribe Bye bye